Welcome back guys. You guys asked for it man. You asked for another tutorial. And I had no ideas on what to make a tutorial on because I'm not that good at art. So I decided on uh, this concept I had of like teaching you how to turn yourself into a cartoon character. Um, I didn't get this idea like just out of nowhere. I was just on YouTube and I get recommended all these videos all the time of how to make yourself look like a cartoon or how to cartoon anybody or how to trace an Adobe or something like that. It's like, man, like it's kind of annoying when I see it, but then I'm like, man, look at those views, man. Look how many views that got. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do this real quick. Oh, don't don't mind this, don't mind this. You just search up uh, your favorite rapper. Let's see, 2019 favorite. I spelled favorite wrong. Don't worry, don't worry. Don't really know how to spell. Um, I don't know any of these rappers. Uh, no chance. Let's just do Chance the Rapper. Chance the Paper. All good. All good. All right. Then you want to find a nice, high quality HD image. So we're probably gonna go for I like this one, but it's not. It's not too cool. Not too cool. Save it to your photos. Boom. And I'm gonna be using Procreate 5 Beta. So I'm gonna be using all the power of Procreate 5 to trace this image. Okay, that's what you're gonna need. You don't actually need Procreate 5. You can do this in uh, Adobe Photoshop. I see a lot of people, like almost everybody. I guarantee you, if you watch another tutorial of this, they're gonna be using Adobe Illustrate or Illustrator. That's like the number one tracing tool. Uh, so if you wanna get good at tracing, that's what you do. But me, I'm gonna use Procreate 5 because it has the power to do this. So basically, you get your image in here. I didn't even show that. You get your image in here, lower the opacity, boom. Make a new layer, boom. Grab you a pen. I have all stock pens in Procreate. So if somebody says, like, oh, you need this pen, you don't need this pen. You just use stock. You don't need to buy anything, man. Nothing. So brush I'm gonna be using studio pen all right put it on black all right make sure streamline all the way up boom max because we have no we have no like steady hand skills man we just got to straight up the computer got to do everything for us so let's see I'll test out the lines too big put it down to like five okay brush size at five what you're gonna do is, boom, literally this is all you're gonna do. Trace. It's not hard, man. Anybody can do it. Anybody can do it. It's It might look good for some people, and then other people might look like doo doo, but you can do it. It doesn't have to be perfect. See, I kinda went off the lines right here. But it's all Gucci. And once you do this, by the end of this video, you're gonna be dropping 100 emojis, flame emojis, and your favorite artist comments saying, "Hey, I do flyers, logos, cover art, all that." So by the time this video is over, you should be doing all that. You should know how to do it. It's gonna come out of you like so natural. You're gonna be annoying everybody. Sometimes you can't really tell what the shapes are. Because like we didn't, we never like studied anatomy and stuff like that, and like face structures. So we kind of had to like wing it, you know. Like if you think a line goes there, just put the line there, man. Like this it looks kind of weird, but uh, it's pretty easy. Kind of has like super arched eyebrows, Dragon Ball Z style. Just wing it, man. If you don't know exactly how to do it, just do it. And the eyes like the favorite part because sometimes you draw these but when you trace them they kind of like like they're dead inside because the eyes are just like ugh. 
but you can fix it. You can make it look nice and pretty. Oh my god, I'm like Picasso. It's gonna be my Instagram name when I start commenting on everybody's pages. I'm like, young Picasso. Mixtape Picasso. Sheesh, guys. I don't even know what I'm going to call this video. How to cartoon yourself, probably. Yeah. I'm going to get all the views, baby girl. Something else I noticed is super weird when people draw teeth or trace teeth, I should say. It looks kind of weird. So to capture that, if we want to be like everybody else, you know, we gotta make it look weird too. So I kind of just wing it. I'm pretty sure that's what like everybody does, huh? Alright, and the hair just strokes. That's it. Doesn't have to be perfect, man. I'm not hanging this up in a gallery or nothing. I hope not. Just strokes, man. That's it. Up, down, up, down. Down, up, down, up. Up, down, up, down. You cannot tell me this is not like Chance the Rapper. Sheesh. Sheesh. Just coloring that hair. Got a little dimple right there. A little bit of curvatures right here. Sheesh. That could be an art teacher up in this bag. Sheesh. Just up and down, guys. Stroke, stroke it. Stroke, stroke. Stop. This sounds wrong. All right, done, basically. I'm gonna show you something, another little secret these, these guys don't want you to know, okay? Every single one who leaves a comment on my page, at least, they're like, check out my art, 100 emoji, flame, flame, flame emoji. Um, They say check out my art. So check out their art, okay? Because I was there at one point, like, I wanted people to check out my art, but I never commented on anybody's page to check out my art. Um, so I checked out his art, and he made this. This is what he did. Every single one I checked out. I get these comments like once a week. It's like it's boom, right? Wait, it's next over here more. Boom, boom, right? But then he does like some little drippage stuff. Like, it looks kind of spooky. A little drippage. That's this. It guaranteed 95% of these Instagrams you go to, they have this drippage. And it looks pretty cool. But I'm gonna do one further. I'm gonna put like a little drippage hole right here, like it split up a little bit. And a little drippage droppage right there. Ooh, chain over looking kind of KO. Boom, look at that. That's what we got. How easy was that? That took me, let's see, my canvas. That took me like five minutes. What does it say? Boom, it says the time I made it. It doesn't say the time. 10 minutes. That's because I had it open before I started the tutorial. It took me like five minutes. You guys can count it. Alright, all right. this is what else we're going to do, alright? Procreate. This is a Procreate tip right here. I don't know if you can do this in any other program, but Procreate. Put this bad boy on reference. Boom, your lines. Go down to the layer underneath it. And we're going to make him a weird color like pink. Let's make him pink. Boom, pink just looks hella crispy. Alright, let's color in them eyes a little bit. Guys, I should be charging for this, this stuff right here. Like, this is top of the line tutorial I'm probably gonna make a gum road and put it on my gum road for like a f fans only don't forget this little drip droppage over here sheesh sheesh all right hard parts done now it's the easy part 
So, easy thing you can do, make a new layer, tap on it, put on a clicking mask, clipping mask. Pick another color, like we can keep it on pink. Put the layer on multiply. Bam. Grab that inking brush again. Bam. Where'd you go? Studio down here. Then we're just gonna guess where the shadows are. You can look at the original image. Just bring it back up. Get out of here, Boda. Right, we can look at the original image and try to imitate those shadows. So he has like these thick ones under here, but that multiply don't look right. Let's change it to like blue. There we go, sugar. Load opacity a little bit. There we go, sugar. Alright. We're just gonna try to imitate those shadows. Easy as that. I'll tell you, I'll show you another technique that a lot of them do. A lot of these uh Adobe Illustrator artists, I want to call them. No offense to Adobe Illustrator, man. I love Adobe Illustrator, but it is like crosshatch. But if you want it to be easy, boom, boom. Get the shadow from his hat. Take it off reference. I'm a noob. Boom. And then his nose. Boom. A little bit of shadow right there. Boom. A little bit of shadow right there. Boom. Boom. Top lip. Boom. Weird teeth. We're just gonna wing it. Remember I said wing it, brother. Don't look so weird no more, baby. We got like a shadow over here too. Guys, that's basically it. We're done. And we just made the most hype beast uh, cartoon yourself art you probably ever seen. And you can do this for anybody. I mean, anybody. But anyways, to practice, I want you guys to just drop a comment below saying like, Flint, give me a bunch of emojis and just say, check out my art. I do CD covers, logos, all that stuff. And I, I just wanna know and I'll check you guys out. And uh, if you guys do this tutorial, tag me on Instagram so I can see what you did, man. Um, hope you guys enjoy. And uh, peace out. But honestly, before I go again, just like the last video I did, I want to say this is a joke. Okay? Like, I'm not trying to condone this stuff. I'm just like making people aware. Like, if you're going to do this art, please don't go commenting on other artists' Instagrams and stuff like that saying flame emojis and all that saying you got art check it out I like you're like uh, i know you're trying to grow but i mean like uh, this is just like you're just tracing and it kind of hurts the community the art community i feel like i put this in a box you know like cause i do like a lot of rap art and i'm like in a box like i feel like i don't get taken seriously because i do art of rappers or musicians and stuff like that but uh i'm just like in a box with the tracers man and it kind of sucks so if you guys are gonna trace please just trace get better um, while you trace, identify what you're tracing, like the shapes and all that, so you can get better. Um, just don't keep tracing. But um, I hope you guys enjoy this uh, public service announcement. And um, I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out.